all versus rising soul family so i had this thought this is something that you know majority of my biological relatives on my mom's side never really thought about when it comes to animals and humans animals and humanoids on planet earth right so when it comes to animals you notice how animals from armadillos to every animal that you saw on planet earth they're not considered homeless but when it comes to humanoids when you see a humanoid that do that doesn't live in like a mechanical shelter and all that stuff like they're considered homeless but when it comes to animals you can see an animal at night or in the daytime all by itself all by herself his self whether that animal is a he or a she and they're not going to be considered homeless because animals don't pay money to be living on a planet but these humanoids these humanoid extraterrestrials got to pay money to be living on planet earth because the slave owner societies was made by the demon world the demon underworld people that are not humans right these demon species have a names of the unknown that we never heard of before, whether they draconians or whatnot. So when it comes to animals, why is it that animals don't pay money to be living on planet Earth, but these humans do? You ever thought of that, man? That's wild to me. If an animal can live, if an animal can be living on planet Earth, out in the open anywhere an animal can go anywhere and live and be living on planet earth for free but when it comes to humanoids they don't see what animals see that's wild to me and that just really makes you think that really makes you think animals they they can literally they can literally be at a at a casino spot in a parking lot and be feeling free but if you have a humanoid that's in a casino spot in a parking lot, if they don't have no place to like lay their head on, th then most humans feel homeless. But animals, they don't feel homeless at all. That's wild. Tell me what you think. Tell me for those that's on Snapchat, TikTok, or all these social medias, tell me what you think about that. Because that that really what I'm talking about right here can really hit your head real hard and make you be like, damn, animals are not homeless, but humanoids are. Why why are humanoids that are living on planet Earth that don't have any form of shelter, whatever whether it's a one bedroom or two bedroom or three or four, however many bedrooms the home is, if a humanoid extraterrestrial doesn't even have a home they're they're labeled homeless but an animal don't need to have a shelter that's that's like mechanical of made that's like mechanical made of a building like animals could just go anywhere on planet earth and it won't be considered homeless man that's wild to me man